Hmm. Hi everyone, this is Mantaha again, your fitness guru. Well, I have had a couple of questions on my Insta and on my YouTube about neck and cervical pain. Uh, I just want to give you all uh, this short video where you can stretch your neck. Um, I know that there are different exercises that you can do and yoga is excellent for that, especially the fish pose. And you can do the fish pose standing as well if you have any problems getting on the floor and doing it. What you could do is you can step forward, place your hands on the wall, go back as much as you can and stretch your neck like this. Do this for three cycles of breath and you should be fine. Um, another exercise that I have seen a lot of people do at the gym is going this way when they are working out or they are stretching their neck. Uh, please, that is not allowed. It was, a, it's, a, it's an old exercise which was used in the 1970s and 1980s. Uh, the neck exercises have been changed. And for now, we have to hold our neck either from the side or from the center or from here, from the back. And you have to move it, give it support, move it on the right, Press your hand into your neck so there is a stretch on your left side if you are working on your with your left hand. And then similarly, move towards your right using your right hand. Hold your head for support so there is no stress on your cervical area. And then press your head in your palm like this or press it on your fingers. This will give you a nice stretch and also use your hands like this, supporting your head, your forehead and press your head in your palm. This will help your cervical muscle and your nerves from the back. Uh, these are a few exercises that would help you stretch and also uh, there's another uh, upper back and a cervical stretch which, you, which is used in physical therapy as well or you can call it physiotherapy which is use your hand, press the wall, keep your arm straight and turn around. That's one. It's going to not only help your upper back because all these muscles are connected. And then you can do this with your hand inverted upside down. Keep it straight and turn around like that. That's going to help you with your stretch. You can do both of these sides and you will feel much, much better. Then we have normal stretches which is your rotations your shoulder rotations backwards and your shoulder rotations forward. Inhale when you go back, exhale when you go front. Well, these are a couple of exercises. Uh, let me know how did you feel. If there's something else that you would like to know, I would love to share this information with you. Lots of love, be safe and be healthy.